In this unit, we will explore various settings available in the Theme Solver. Under the General tab of the Solver Property Editor window, the Simulation Region parameter selects which of the simulation regions from the object's tree will be used by the solver. Note that only one simulation region can be assigned to a solver at a time. Under the Mesh tab, the global mesh constraints define the degree of refinement of the simulation mesh. The number of edges per wavelength determines the target for the size of the triangular elements in the finite element mesh. Enabling or disabling the option, refine based on material properties, determines if the refinement is based on the effective wavelength inside the materials or on the wavelength in vacuum. Higher values for the number of edges per wavelength mean a more refined mesh and possibly more accurate results. However, this might be at the expense of increased execution time and memory. The polynomial order corresponds to the order of the basis functions used in the finite element solver. This setting does not affect the mesh and allows you to resolve nonlinear variations in the electric field better, even with a coarse mesh. By adjusting the edges per wavelength and the polynomial order, it is possible to find a good balance between accuracy and computational cost of the simulator. There are some additional advanced options for meshing. In most simulations, it is not necessary to modify the default values for these settings, so we won't discuss them in this course. Under the Modal Analysis tab, you will find the settings for the Eugen mode calculation. You need to specify the frequency or wavelength of the desired modes, as well as the number of trial modes. The solver will look for modes with an effective index near a given value. You can specify this value directly or let the solver use the maximum refractive index in the simulation region by enabling the Use Max Index option. Finally, we have the Advanced tab. Similar to the Advanced options under the Mesh tab, the default settings here are appropriate in most cases. Therefore, we won't discuss this tab in this course. 